Hey guys, today I'm going to show you my druid build. Let's get started. Oh no, the box! Since Blizzard announced the druid's buff coming up, I figured I'd show my build. The fire druid is by far the strongest for leveling, but falls off in hell mode because of the massive amounts of fire mutants. The wind druid is very versatile and handles most content quite easily. Your Tornado does physical damage and is your highest damage dealing skill. Your secondary damage comes from Hurricane, which does cold damage, which is nice for those physical immunes and the AoE slow utility it gives. So for skills, you want to max Tornado first. And then after Tornado, you want to max Hurricane. After Hurricane, you can max Cyclone Armor. After Cyclone Armor, you max Twister. This next part may be subject to change since they are buffing summons soon. But after you max all your elemental synergies, you max out Oak Sage and put the rest into Grizzly. For gear, you don't have to have Enigma, but it helps. It just helps. If you don't have Enigma, Viper Mage is fine. Uh, Nages also works. Helmet, you can use Shaco as your lols. You can also use Nightwing's Veil. In hand, you can use Heart of the Oak. If that's too expensive, you can just use a Spirit. Spirit Sword. Best in slot for your gloves is Mage Fist. If you don't have that, Tranjul's Claws work as well. Trange Owls. Train Owls. However you want to pronounce it. For boots I personally use Sandstorm Trek but you can use War Travelers. For an amulet I use a plus three to elemental skiller to maximize my elemental damage and plus 95 to life. Faster cast rate would have been nice. Speaking of faster cast rate I also use faster cast rate rings. Very, very important. Best in slot for belt is Arachnid Mesh. But if you don't have that, uh, tell, tell belt works. For small charms, I just usually have plus lifers and then whatever else I could find. So for grand charms, I have a uh, couple of elemental skillers. I have four elemental skillers at the moment. And uh, a Gates Fortune as well as a, uh, a 2019 Druid Torch. Insight Merc also helps. So buffed up, I have over 4k health, and my Tornado does 5.5k damage. So let's try some Eldritch real quick. Take it on pretty quick. This is also just player's one. The overs here. Carbon some Pindle. So Elemental Druid doesn't have to worry about too many immunes. It can handle most of the uh, end game content without really any issues. And you know what, what still hurts when you have 4k HP? Stiggy and dolls. They still hurt. Would you look at that? Watch my health. They just, they just destroy you, dude. There's like... It's not fun. Stygian dolls are just not fun. These won't let you have fun ever. And Bale's laughing at my expense. Thank you. A three-socket ethereal monarch. Honestly, if you're just playing players one, um, the druid's just fine. I mean, it's not, uh, it's not the best in terms of damage. Like, uh, hammered in does a little more. This guy teleports so much. So annoying. 
So unfortunately, it takes a second for your nados to start hurting. But uh, after you get your nados going, it it chunks them pretty good. We got a health slayer. So if you're just here by yourself, make a druid, make a little windy druid, have some fun. Super fun. Super tanky, a lot of health. <laughs> What's wrong with a lot of health? Look at that, nice amrune. Oh yeah. Just heard a block there. What's my block chance? Nice. 90%. If you made it this far in the video, like and subscribe. It would help a ton to grow my channel. Also, comment down below and tell me what you'd like to see next. See y'all next time. Your tornado. Your tornado. Your tornado. <laughs> Jesus. Your tornado. Why can't I say that without sounding weird? <clears throat> Your tornado is... <laughs> Why is it so hard to say your turn Tornado? I can't say The tornado... <laughs> <laughs> the tornado skill... <clears throat> That's all for my Wind Druid build guide. If you like... If you made it this far... In the, if you made it this far in the video, like and subscribe. It'd help a ton. <laughs> if you made it this far, like and subscribe. Jesus Christ.